Hey guys, it's Cal, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are here with Polly, my Blue Crown Conure, which actually I wanted to make a comment about. I know when I originally introduced him, I introduced him as Quinn, but I did end up like literally a week or so after I got him home, I renamed him Polly after one of my childhood favorite movies, which has a blue crown named Polly, and I just love this movie so much, so it was like when I got my own blue crown, I kind of felt like I had to, so if you hear me in some videos referring to him as Quinn, and in other videos, you're loud, referring to him as Polly, that is why his name is Polly, it is the same bird though, the same bird though, it's just... He was renamed. So it is same bird. Alright, now that we got that out of the way, today's video is going to be a haul from my vlog. The last vlog that I posted. Oh, hi, baby. The last vlog that I posted where I went to in a pickle parrot shop, which is my favorite, one of my favorite bird shops. And. They have really good deals and stuff. The people are amazing there. And I wanted to show my haul of everything that I got there. So let's get into it. First, here's all of our stuff. First, I wanted to comment, uh, excuse you. First, I wanted to comment on how awesome it is that they used paper bags instead of plastic because I try to be as low impact, zero waste as possible, and plastic bags are a huge no-no in my my personal life. My parents use them still, but the people I live with use them still, but I personally am about as anti-plastic bag as they come. So the fact that without me even asking, they used paper bags really made, made me smile. I like that a lot. So let's get into what we bought here. First off, we bought these, oops, stuff all over them. I got these Nutra Berries featuring popcorn. If you can see them, hold them up so you can see them. These I got because actually Polly here loves popcorn and he loves Nutra Berries. So I thought he would probably like these. And I know that... Rio likes popcorn, but he doesn't like Nutriberries, so I figured I would try that with him. And the rest of my birds, they like Nutriberries and popcorn, so. These I figured would be a... What are you doing? What are you doing? Would be a good trait. Also, if you hear my doves cooing in the background, yeah, they're cooing. Come on, step up. There we go. Next up, we got this. I'm sorry about the doves in the background, but they're cute. We got this little, it's like a shredder toy, but this is actually Tiki's favorite type of toy. It's like these little, if you can see it, like little nets. And it goes all the way around and they like, I'm sorry, it goes like all the way around and they like stick the paper in there, which is really cool. And Tiki had one from probably last year, I want to say, because it was in his cage outside and it when we would go outside in the summer for some sunshine. And it is in his indoor play stand and he just destroyed it. Like he just ripped the whole thing apart and he's been so sad about it. He loves these. So I got that for Tiki. What else did we get? Oh, I got a small one too for the doves. Excuse you. It's a virtual zoo around here. Look at this. Doves in the background. It's darn zoo. There you go, Polly. So I got another one for the doves. It's just a little shredder ball toy. Same same thing as what Tiki's is, but it's smaller because they got little, little smaller beaks and can then like pull the paper. 
then I got a big bag of, can you see it? Just dried fruit mix. It has in there apple dices, papaya dices, pineapple, coconut flakes, and cranberries, which is really good. These guys love, what are you doing, child? These guys love their dried fruit. So I got a bag of that. I also got a bag of dried veggies. He just won't stop going on my head, so he's just gonna sit there for now. I wanted him to be down here so you could like see him in the video, but he's insistent on being up there. So that's just where he is for now. Which, there's these. These are great. They're just dried veggies. I add it on top of their pellet mixes. And it just helps get extra veggies in there. Even though I do feed, chop, and uh, fresh veggies on the daily. I also like to include dry veggies in there because it just adds extra, extra veggie content. Next up, I got... A couple of these natural wood perches to just kind of add to my cages because I needed to add more cage more perches to my dove cage because since doves can't climb the bars vertically like a parrot can because they are soft bills I wanted to add more perches they kind of hop from perch to perch so I wanted to add some more perches into their cage so we got three of these natural wood perches. This one's like a little two piece. This one's kind of a skinnier one. And this one's, yeah. So we got some perches. I also got a few of these. Uh, there's another one in here too. Of these little solo ball thingies. Mango is obsessed with these. He prefers the other one, but those are actually going to be back ordered until, I think, June, I think I was told. I'm not sure. April, June, somewhere like that. But, Mango loves these. So, these are comparable, so I got him some of those, which those will be all chewed up in, like, no time. I also got a bunch of foot toys for everybody. There's more in here. They fell to the bottom of the bag, but oops, I dropped one. You know, you're making this very difficult, bird. <laughs> Look at my hair. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? But I got some of these just little plastic like foot toys. Here, you want one? Yeah, okay. Put out that. And then some of these just little shaped ones. Some of these other ones, like you can add it to the perch. Like see there's a little hole in there. You can like slide it on the perch so they can like kind of rotate it and spin it and stuff like that. So I got some foot toys. And I got this little toy for also the doves because they like ringing little bells, so I got them this super cute little bell toy. And I generally have found that smaller toys like that are good for the doves because with such small soft beaks, they're able to grab these type of smaller toys better. So it's a little bell toy for the for the doves. And this I actually had to stop at Pet Supply Plus for because they didn't have them at the parrot shop, but these are Polly's absolute favorite treats. He gets them like once a day during training, but these are like, if I'm gonna get him to do something for training, this is the way to go. It's just these little peanut sesame things. And last, but certainly not least, and the thing I'm most excited about is, I got Polly a aviator harness. They are quite expensive, as you can see there, $35. But I figured since he is so young, I wanted to get him started on 
harness training at a very young age because I would like for him to be able to go to bird shows with me or go to pet stores with me or just generally go for walks outside with me and be able to be harnessed and safe. So we're going to be starting harness training and I'm probably going to vlog that whole experience so everyone can see how that whole thing goes. And that is... That is it. There's some little thingies in here from those chew toys. But yeah, that is it. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye. Say bye, Polly. Bye. Say bye. <laughs> bye, guys. <laughs>